Hmm. Hi, Tuval. This is a NeuroSky MindWave mobile sensor. It is used uh, for reading your MindWave readings. This app working. It is working based on Bluetooth. Here I wrote the program in Shisha, which is used to collect the readings of brainwave signals. The port is COM7. Here I have to place this sensor to my head. Okay, now you should place the sensor like this in head. Now I start reading the values. Of calm seven. You have to. Okay. Now the readings are captured. It will return the positive value. It will return the negative value. Signal strength is fifty one. Here I pass some triggers like forward, backward, left, and right. Based on that, the operation will be uh, held on. Here, the signals will be indicating via graphical units. Here, if I remove the sensor in my uh, ear, automatically, automatically the signal will be stopped on that destination end. Now see, some values will be coming after five seconds. See now, the complete uh, working is stopped right now. Now I switch on the. Now I switch on the sensor again. See here, I have to pin this in my ears. Now it will be getting started. So automatically, this will be uh, working and providing the triggers based on our uh, uh, sensor value. If I stop collecting reading, automatically it will be getting stopped. So here I am using uh, some DLLs. Thingier support DLL, Thingier uh, DLL, Thingier straight DLL. So these are all the DLLs I am using. Based on this, it is working more fine. Here I wrote two graphs. One is for positive signal, another one is for negative signal, another one is for signal strength. Based on this, the value will be providing. See now, so now forward is providing. Now I am thinking a little bit uh, backward. See now, backward will be providing. Here, left signals will also be getting triggered. So, based on this, the value will be triggered. You can use any uh, end application with the help of this, uh, with the help of this uh, transmitter. And here, I'm using a transmitter unit. So, transmit the data. You can interface it with Zigbee and transmit any data according to this. Thank you for watching.